prayers. All my remind the chairs of committees who were given bills to process that the chairs should be able to, pro to present the bills, especially those who have, whose time have expired. We need these bills to be processed and brought to the house for reconsideration. Some chairs have got the bills and they've sat with it. Nobody is reporting. Nobody is asking for an extension. We need to be seen to work. So if we, you just keep with the bill and you're not coming back to the house either to seek for an extension or to report on how far you've done, then there is a big problem. We are going to act on the chairs who are not reporting back. The committees are stuck. Members cannot go even internally to do the benchmarking. So they cannot go and come up with the conclusions on reports. Some things they need to go and see them physically. And you find these members come to you and tell you, Honorable Commissioner, we don't have the budget to go and do this. And then members get stuck. So I think, right, Honorable Speaker, you have to come out clearly and add your voice strongly to the Minister of Finance to facilitate committees of parliament that uh, since there was an undertaking by the executive that this matter would be addressed, they should come back to this house and tell us how far uh, the issue that was raised by this house concerning uh, the release of finance to parliament to be able to do its work. We do work for executive. And if you cannot facilitate us to do the work for you, then why are we here? You need the bills. You need these reports, but you're not facilitating parliament. So what do you expect of us? You need to help us to help you.